Hello boys and girls, what's up? It's Shuri of course, and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to install the saturation mod for Minecraft 1.6.2 and above. That means it should work for future versions to come. Uh, with that said, we're going to get started right away. Uh, what you need to do is open the link in the description below, and it will take you here to this little webpage here. You can use anything to open it, it doesn't really matter. I'm using Google Chrome. Uh, so what we're going to do is we're just going to scroll down here, and we're going to go to the download section, and we're going to go ahead and get... Uh, it for 1.6.2 because that's the version I'm currently using however you can use whatever version you are let's say you're using 1.7.2 you could download that version and this should work for you um, so go ahead and open uh, this version right here I'm gonna open it in a new tab so you're gonna have to go to an add file link so you are gonna have to wait a couple seconds unfortunately I'm very sorry and go ahead and skip the ad and go ahead and click the download button I actually really like Mediafire I'm very happy they use that I'm gonna close the little spam they sent me Close that right there. Close that. All right, there we go. As you can see, it has downloaded. Uh, I'm going to wait to uh, open it up and stuff. So I'm just going to close this link now. Make sure you get back here to the main page. It is going to have a link to Mod Loader right here. So you can go ahead and click that. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, open it up. And you're going to go ahead and go to the next tab. And we're going to go ahead and scroll down. And we're going to need to download Mod Loader. So that's what we're doing right now because Mod Loader is required to run that mod. Um, I think it is a good thing to keep in mind is that this does not, I believe it does not work very well with Forge by having these two mods together. So if you're putting these together with other mods, be very careful. So we're scrolling down right now and we're looking for Mod Loader. So where is that at? I'm assuming it would be near the top right here. Mod Loader 1.6.2. Uh, whoops, I just clicked a random spam link. Okay, so what you need to do is you need to go ahead and click this little link that says download AdFly. You could download it direct, but I'm going to do the AdFly version just because I support the mod makers and their mod. Um, so unfortunately, we're going to have to wait another five seconds. If you're following along, go ahead and skip the ad, and it should take us to a download link. Oh, there we go. Okay, so automatically downloaded. Now, I'm going to go ahead and open up my downloads folder now, so you guys can go ahead and close the internet. You don't need the internet anymore, so go and close it. Close all your little browser tabs and everything. Uh, so what you're going to see is you're going to see your two download things. Uh, you're going to have Mod Loader and the Saturation Mod right here. So highlight both of these and put them onto your desktop. Okay. So now that you have that done, what we're going to do is we're going to go and close this. Uh, so keep in mind, make sure you just have your stuff on your desktop. It's just going to make the tutorial a lot easier for us. So what we need to do now is go to the bottom left here and type in percent app data percent. Hit enter. Now you need to go ahead and open up your .minecraft folder, which can be found in the roaming folder, which we just opened up. So open that up. And then we need to go to the versions folder inside the .minecraft folder. Now in here, you're going to see a couple folder, or you should see maybe one file, maybe more, depending on how long you've been playing Minecraft for. Um, so right now I have a couple in here. What we're going to do is we're going to copy the 1.6.2 version or whatever version you want to copy. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and copy this and go ahead and paste it. And we're going to go ahead and rename this. Uh, you have to rename it, so make sure you right-click and rename it. And we're just going to name it uh, 1.6.2 um, capital letter SAT. So SAT is going to be the name of our uh, version of Minecraft. So go and open up that 1.6.2 uh, SAT folder. And we need to rename everything in here to 1.6.2 SAT in capital letters or whatever you want to name it. Uh, now it is important to uh, keep in mind to keep the .json extension on the end of this. If it says .json, make sure you keep that. Do not remove that. You need to have that on there or this tutorial won't work. So make sure it's on there. Now what we need to do is we need to actually open up this uh, 1.6.2 in capital letters sat.json file um, and edit it. So we're going to go ahead and use Notepad because I'm not sure if everyone has the program that I use to edit. So we're just going to use Notepad just to be safe. So what you're going to do is you're just going to drag this little file right here over into Notepad. And then we're just going to go ahead and edit it. And we're going to go ahead and change this part where it says ID 1.6.2. We're just going to change that. And we're going to change it to 1.6.2 space SAT or whatever you named it um, so go ahead and uh, hit the X button and save it so that's gonna save our changes to it so now we can actually load up Minecraft and see if it worked but before you do that we do need to actually install mod loader so I did kinda lie to you um, so now the next thing you have to do is you're gonna need to open up uh, this file right here open with and then open it with Winmar or 7-zip um, so now we have it all set up, but now we did right, we're, right now what we're doing is we're actually installing the mods themselves. So we have the setup ready to go, but we need to install the mods, just to clarify what's going on here. Um, so first of all, you have to delete the meta-inf folder. So go ahead and delete that. Hit yes. 
And now we need, what we need to do is open up Mod Loader off our desktop or wherever you have it saved. Open that up and right click and select all and drag and drop it to or drag and drop it into your uh, 1.6.2 in capital letters SAT jar file. So hit OK. And go ahead and close Mod Loader. You don't need that anymore. You can actually delete it or save it. I'm going to open up the saturation mod now off of our desktop right here. And we're going to go ahead and right click, select all, and drag and drop it into the uh, same folder we did before. So right into the 1.6.2 in capital letters SAT jar file. Okay, hit OK. And there you go. I can go and close it. Now we have the mod completely installed. We have it set up and ready to go. So now we can actually launch Minecraft and set up a profile so we can actually begin playing with it. So go ahead and open up your Minecraft wherever you have it at. And what you're going to need to do is you're going to have to go ahead and create a new profile. So new profile. And we're going to name this new profile uh, SA, or what is it? SAT? Okay, SAT in capital letters. Um, what we need to do now is select our version of Minecraft. So right now it's set to use the latest version. So we got to use our version right here, which we just created, 1.6.2 in capital letters SAT or whatever you named it. So go ahead and select that. And just you don't need to have anything here in this arguments, but this allows you to have Minecraft with more RAM. So by default, I have Minecraft using 4 gigs of RAM. So you can set it wherever you want or just uncheck it to use 1. Um, so I'm just going to keep it checked and hit Save Profile. And now what we need to do is click the little Profile button down here and select SAT. Once you have SAT selected, you're just going to go ahead and hit Play. And if we don't get any black screens, that means we did the tutorial correctly. Um, if you do get a black screen for some reason, please, I heavily recommend looking in the description below uh, for any little notes or read the comments perhaps and see what other people have done. Or leave a comment yourself and I will try to reply to you as long as Minecraft is uh, up to 1.6.2. If it's anything over that, I probably won't reply because, you know, mo mods do change, their installations change, so I might not be able to reply to you. Okay, so we're just going to go ahead and go into Minecraft now. Uh, single player. And we're going to go into this one world I created in a previous tutorial. Okay, so I have a texture pack on, so let me turn this off real quick. And, okay, there we go. Okay, so that's probably why it looked weird to everyone else before. Okay, so you can see that there's this, uh, the bar is really weird looking. It's got like a little outline on it, so that would be the saturation mod actually working. Um, I don't really know too much about the mechanics of the mod, but I figured I would just do the mod because it looked really cool. So, yeah, thank you guys for watching. As usual, please rate and subscribe. And if you want to do, uh, if you need help with any other videos on how to install any other mod, you can always watch my other videos. There will be a link at the end of this video, so you can click that and go look at all my other videos I've done on how to install any other mod. Um, feel free to request mods, leave a comment below, and I will try to do them next because I don't really know what other mods you guys want. So, uh, so yeah, thank you guys for watching. Uh, see you later. Thank <laughs> you.